welcome to the cloud network in this tutorial i am going to show you about how to install the chart labs os uh, that is in your virtual box you can also install in your website so first of all you need to download the virtual box this is the web website of virtual box and uh, you can find this link also in a video and in the description box also and uh, this is having the latest version 5.1.2 sorry and the windows support it so if you click on this one it will be automatically start and downloading and the links you have to open full editor type 64 bit whether you are on 32 bit also you can replace the 64 bit and so on and you have to go to the site this is the on the page of website here you can see this is a chocolate os so you can site bar is the website of this one. So, you can read about the minimum requirement of the system before proceeding. This uh, processor 1 gigahertz and the RAM you can have 5 million bits here. And also, you can have you can from the uh, CD or DVD or from the pen drive, also, it's enough to have pen drive. 4GB uh, for the installation and CD set so you can have uh, DVD you can show the screen resolution 1076 and then this is also you can see uh, it's having 32 bit and 64 bit two types of uh, download is there and uh, whichever you want for the uh, Having the 64 bit, and this one which is automatically start the download, which I have already been downloaded. And uh, you want to uh, watch a few things, you can watch my video. Uh, here is about the new watch of installation, which I have made the video. Uh, you can find this link also in the description box. So let's begin now our installation. You need to give a uh, name here. Provide the name like I am giving. So I am giving this uh, number 64 bit. Here yeah, 32 bit also. Also, you can uh, select 32 bit or 64 bit. After that, click next. You need to assign last to the green point. Then click next. Next. Then you need to click on next. Next. Uh, this is the location where it is going to install in your laptop or desktop. And this is the size for your hard disk. You want to size for this hard disk. I am giving 25 GB. And you can uh, move to the uh, 25 GB from above. So to create it now. You need to go to the settings here and system so that it's first CD so image then is going to boot the hard disk. So you to select one, you need to click on storage, empty click on empty, click on storage, you need to choose the location where you have downloaded the ISO image. This is the this is my 64 bit, double click, sign it to network. Select your bridge adapter. Click OK. And click to start it now. So on the screen, you can see we came on the installation media and uh, click on live uh, channel OS. That means without the installation, you can proceed just you can uh, channel OS without installation. If you want to install, just go to the install child OS directly or you can go with the save more graphical also this live just select and press and enter so we can see on the screen we came on installation media we need to select the language and you need to click on continue once you select the language and then you need to proceed with the next step this is the first step and this is your installation type like you want to download that third party installation and you want to install with the Wi-Fi drivers, others, MP3 also. We can check this box and you can proceed. 
but I am skipping to the next step. This is your installation type we kept on the main type, uh, main configuration we kept. Uh, before taking, uh, before continuing with the installation, please take a backup of your data, whatever you have in the data. If you are installing virtual apps, then you can okay. But if you are installing a desktop, laptop means you know take a backup of your data and then proceed. If you stop the manually partition, then you need to select this one and you need to proceed with the installation. Just take this option now. That means it will be automatically create the partitions. So if you want to have get some, you want to make the changes to the list means you need to go back and then continue. Here we have the two partitions created. So I am clicking the Okay. Now we came on the uh, time of your uh, in time zone of your our country. So it has been automatically taking continue. Then we need to give the uh, username the keyboard layout language. Select and continue. So we came on here to be R. That means we need to give a username. I am giving out network. And I am giving the uh, password. Please, you need to give a strong password and please remember this password while giving click into continue now here we is going to be installing and uh, here the formatting everything will be done here so it will take some time here 25 minutes here then you can have your uh, personal work other kind of uh, if you want to do is you can go ahead and then back I will show you the welcome screen here oh, <coughs> the installation completed I am going to restart it now just click to restart it if you are also getting this kind of uh, remove the installation warnings you can that one just uh, this virtual box and then click settings and then click, click system uncheck floppy and then click ok then start it now so you can see on the screen this is our select and press and enter now I'm going to log in it here. Just to close this one. Now this is the See how it's looking very beautiful. It's like same windows. It's and uh, this has been made on based on Windows only. So and uh, like, so let, let me show you the full screen resolution. And for that one, let us see if it's working or not. No, working the full screen resolutions here. You need to click on device, so all the guess addition this. So that will make you a full screen resolution. If you install this device, go to and just install the guess addition. And now automatically mounted okay we need to run this here um, okay we are going to have your navigate run like this one select this one or double click So what I did is, uh, I just click it on 64 bit. If you install 32 bits, just click on 
uh, run with the program and like this one you know to open this application program so it will be open in a bind which uh, by default uh, has been installed and then you have to click on install it now so my friends after complete installation uh, just you have all you have to do is restore your uh, this virtual box you can check the solutions for watching my video uh, if you get any problem during the switch you can comment below to my video uh, like us and share my video among your friends and relatives uh, if you want me to make a video or you want to donate to the club network you can donate through the um, on my paypal or you can donate through the credit cards also or also you can donate through the western unions anything just email me itcloudnet at the rate gmail.com anything you require from me uh, i will be replying you guys thanks for watching my video